everybody, it's Titanic Feed Jack, and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're gonna look at sneakers that retro in 2023. It seemed like this is the new thing now for Nike slash Jordan brand, the retro sneakers that we got like 10 years ago, maybe some later than that or some earlier than that, but we received a lot of shoes, a lot of shoes retro. As I look like, shoot, it's about who 20 to 15 shoes that I'm actually gonna go over that I have here. There's more, but I didn't bring them all because I didn't want to keep you guys here all day. But before we get into it, I need a couple of things from you. I need you guys to hit that like button on today's video. Also, do hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a video. And sub up to the channel if you haven't already. Now, you guys probably already seen my top 15 pickers of 2023. If you haven't already, I strongly recommend you go check it out after you watch this video. You know, I'm asking you guys to check that out and do it that like button when you get over there. Now, some of my favorite sneakers that retro in 2023, uh, we may have forgotten about, so we just gonna start right here. This is a classic. We got the Jordan 13 playoff, the playoff 13. Yes, these did retro in 2023. Uh, not sure why they didn't come with the Roman number 13 under the flap. That was like the only, uh, controversy so to speak with these but other than that it came back just like og farm pretty much really clean pair had to have them to the collection because when they came out your boy didn't get them but uh i got them now this was one secret that retro in 2023 let's go with another we got the lebron four soldier the all black the anthracite I was happy to see this sneaker retro, you know, add this to my work collection. I know they look like boot stompers, but the weather down here in Louisiana is bipolar. So we can be raining one day, well, start off the morning with rain, and you know, it'll get hot, it'll rain again, it get cold all in the same day. You don't believe me? Come visit Louisiana long enough. And you will see. So this is a pair to add to the collection. So the rain just rolls right off. The LeBron Full Soldier in the anthracite colorway. Uh, what we have next? Uh, I gave you guys a Jordan. Let's go with something else. We got the Adidas Yeezy V1 Pirate Black. Those retro to us in 2023 as well. You know, I didn't get them when they first came out. 2022, we got the... Maybe even 2021, we got the Turtle Doves in the V1. So, last year, 2023, they blessed us with the Pirate Black. So, what will 2024 hold? Will we get the Moon Rock? Not sure what's going on with Adidas and Kanye. So, stay tuned. This is another sneaker. Oh, let's go. Something different. We got the Nike SB down below in the weak colorway. The SB Weeks. Yep, they uh retro to us this year too. Nice clean pair. Rock that in the fall. Basically your low top Timberlands for us guys down here in the South. S-O-U-F, you heard me? Yep. Nice sneaker that retro to us. I like these, you know, had to add them to the collection. Let's see what else we have here that retro to us. Uh mm. We got the KD Zoom 3, the uh, Aunt Pearls. They retro to us too. Nice sneaker, had to add it to the collection. You know, a great cause. This sneaker was for a great cause, breast cancer awareness. And you have Aunt Pearl back here on the back heel for, and K.Y.L. K.Y.L. was the famous uh, basketball coach. I forgot what team she coached, but she coached collegially. And Aunt Pearl is one of Kevin Durant's aunts that suffered with breast cancer. So this is another sneaker that retro to us. Uh, the next sneaker is the Playoff 8s. Yep, the Playoff 8s. We got those back. This was toward the latter of the year, but uh, 
had to have these, never had them before. Really clean. And with that pull tab, just like they did originally with the red pull tab. They retro a couple times from the original release date, but they did not have that red pull tab. This is the first time we got that red pull tab. So this is another good one that retro in 2020. What else we got here? Oh, this is a sneaker I wore recently, the Jordan 5 Burgundy. This is another one that retro to us. You know, not a lot of hype behind a sneaker. Nonetheless, it is very clean, very, you know, real good. I like this sneaker. You know, I had to get it. I didn't have it originally, but it's just something different. See, these side 15 is going to attract a lot of attention due to the side. So I may as well get something that's going to stand out set myself apart from the people i'm walking among so you know this is the jordan 5 burgundy another good sneaker the retro in 2023 here we go guys here's another sneaker the retro in 2023 the air max 185 big bubble yes this was a good one of all these a couple of times uh i didn't have them when they came out originally because you know Miles and Pops was still buying my sneakers back then, but since I'm able to, you know, support myself and support my habit, because all these sneakers, this is a habit. You have to be able to support your habit. So uh, I'm supporting my habit pretty decently, but you know, I'm trying to downside the collection and get more OG classics like this into the collection, like the Big Bubble. This was another good one that was retro in 2023. Okay, guys, another sneaker right here that retro in 2023. This is another recent one, the Fury 3s. Uh, you can catch these on sale right now. They're uh, on sale all over the place. JD Sports finish line, but I didn't get it. There's rumors swirling around, or maybe it's confirmed that we are getting the Jordan 4 Fears this year in 2024 so uh so another one to add to the pack you know trying to be like my boy d guy juice completing these packs so trying to complete the fear pack so this is step one you know how i ran that first leg of the race with the jaw and three fear another good sneaker that retro to us in 2023 here we go guys, another sneaker that retro to us in 2023, the Nike Zoom KD3 Christmas. Yes, it's another recent one. Bright, vibrant shoe and it's light. I love it. I love these KDs, but this uh, KD3, it spoke volumes to me when I saw it was gonna retro. And I said I had to have it and uh, I was blessed enough to get these for retail. So. This was a good pickup, a good retail cop for me, you know, and another good sneaker that retro right here in 2023. Here we go, guys. Another sneaker that retroed in 2023, the Jordan 12 Cherries. Yes, didn't have these the first time around either, but uh, your boy got them in the collection. Now, you know, these sneakers are double up worthy. The, uh, the retros, the, uh, let me see, that, that, that. Yeah, I think I doubled up in a lot of these sneakers except one of them, the ones that retro. But hey, uh, these, you know, you got that lizard print on here, your two, three. You, it's a must have if you're a sneaker here and you got a collection. Gotta have the OG. So the Cherry 12 was another good sneaker that we had come back to us in 2023. And the last sneaker that I'm gonna show you guys right here. It's actually raining outside and thunder. There you go, baby, the thunder foes. We had these come back to us. I'm happy I sprayed these with that crap mink oil. Cause all I gotta do is just knock this dust off, you know what I'm saying? But the thunder foes, this uh, was a good sneaker. It's about time that we get it back a couple years ago. Uh, actually, in 2021, yeah, we was evacuated for Hurricane Ida on that Saturday when they gave us the uh, the lightning force. They retro that to us in 2021 in late August. So now in 2023, a couple years later, they gave us the thunder to complete the set. So out of all these sneakers I uh, showed you guys today, uh, 
let me know in the comment section which pair what's your favorite to retro this year yeah the jordan 6 taro that was another one that retro to us i didn't show you guys that to, uh today but that was another good one i could have showed you guys the gratitude or the dmp 11 but uh that one retro to us but the materials was different so i didn't kind of consider that a retro but uh these are the kicks let me know your thoughts about what you think is one of the best or your favorite sneaker to retro in 2023 and i'm gonna go ahead in this video like i always tell you guys if you can help somebody get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know it'll be your turn to need help getting a sneaker i'm titanic feet jack signing out